welcome back to my channel i hope you all are having a blessed day and i've been saving a couple months of dollar tree household Love empties those. So first off, we have the aluminum sheets. Um, these are great. I love them. They are perfect for lining pans, food storage. I also use it for food storage and covering pans. They're the perfect size for their cookie sheets. I love them. And I think a great deal for $30 for a dollar. The 40 square foot aluminum foil. I get this all the time. I like it, but it is really thin. It rips easily. Sometimes the... Um, it doesn't rip off quite right but for a dollar honestly you really cannot beat it I don't and it's not a heavy-duty aluminum foil either like I said like you'll want to get the heavy-duty but it is good for lining pans and storing leftovers next up is the good sense handle bags these are my favorite garbage bags hands down from there I love the nice vanilla scent and they don't rip easily they have handles they hold a lot I really like these um, the Good Sense Flap Ties or a recent purchase and I got these because I couldn't find handles but they have a spring scent which is really nice. They didn't hold as much as the handle bags even though they're the same size. Um, they didn't hold as much but and they ripped easier than the handle bags would. Um, I still would repurchase these because I didn't hate them. I really did like them but I'm just in comparison they don't hold as much even though they're the same gallon size and they ripped um, easier the good sense zipper seal bags the the quart bags love these I use them for food storage and um, I like taking it putting my meats in them and marinating them in them and the quart size is perfect and they're freezer bags as well they work great in the freezer I've used them in the freezer and no freeze burn issues. Now, this is the Sure Fresh um, snack bags. 50 in here for a dollar, what's not to love? They are um, good little bags. I mean, they're just snack bags. And I always like to take Connor a snack to church or like to pack in my purse for the park or church and things like that. Somewhere, if I know we're gonna be somewhere for a while, these baggies are perfect for packing some goldfish, some Cheetos. Um, even some m and Skittles, things like that. These are awesome and I will repurchase those. Now I've talked about these before. I highly recommend picking up some of these SureFresh cover-ups if you have not tried them. There's 20 in here. There's five small, eight medium, and seven large. And these are fantastic for covering bowls. And I definitely highly, highly recommend these. Some of these products you'll find full reviews on and that review uh, playlist will be in the description box. Um, the SureSense Angel Blossom Solid Gel Air Freshener. Loved this. It lasted forever. The scent was strong. Perfect for small areas like your bathroom. This was amazing and will continue to repurchase. Now I have the in-wash scent booster, the lavender one. This one was good, I, but it's not as good as the fresh scent. Like it's kind of faint scent. You get less product. You get three and a half ounces compared to 15 ounces. And the fresh scent is my complete go-to. Um, this is more like a crystal rock kind of thing. This one looked like your like wax melts or a fabric softener kind of pellet. And um, yes, absolutely love these. Highly recommend the fresh scent. Love, 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 love. The scent lasts on your clothes forever. Um, laundry detergent. I always repurchase LA's Totally Awesome 2-in-1 Laundry Detergent. There's 32 loads in there. as plus fabric softener. It's a nice fresh scent. It's not a super potent scent though. So you might want the scent booster. Um, but I do find it gets my clothes clean. I don't have any issues with that. And I do two. I do large loads. So I do two capfuls. Sometimes two and a half to be honest. But um, this lasts a long time for me. And yes, it, it works. I like it. And you get 64 fluid ounces for a dollar. Love it. Um, a fabric softener, Breezy. There's 55 sheets in here. And this was their fresh linen scent. Smells amazing. So strong and potent. And it's a fabric softener. It does what it says. It claims. And I liked it. 
I've done a full review on, once again, some of these products I'm getting ready to show. But this is the Blue and Bleach 2 tablets. Now this is before they actually changed it and now they do one tablet for a dollar. Still a good deal. This does last a bit in your toilet. It does help keep your toilet clean and it turns it a nice blue color if you're into that thing so I like these a lot and this is the foaming super oxygen bathroom cleaner from Homebrite I always repurchase this it's a one of those sprays blue turns white when it's ready to clean and you get 14 and a half fluid ounces love love this product I use it mainly in the bathtub but I will use it sometimes um, on the toilet you can use it anywhere in your bathroom basically and it is comparable to the Kaboom Foam Tastic and I have a um, tub and shower cleaner from the works I did like this you get one pint so 16 fluid ounces in this and I mainly liked it for the toilet but in comparison to the Lime Away I prefer the Lime Away um, it did work good in the shower but it's very watery so it didn't cling to the sides and really clean as well as the Lime Away but still a good product nonetheless and I would repurchase this if I could not find the Lime Away Okay, last for bathroom we have I have a ton of these bath tissue wrappers but a lot of people hate on this toilet paper I like this toilet paper but this toilet paper is not super fuzzy it's not rough in my opinion it lasts forever you get 275 sheets per row and you get four rows for a dollar this is I like this toilet paper and so does my family so I continue to repurchase it it's a good deal Moving on to kitchen stuff here, I have two packages of the Scrub Buddies Nail Guard Sponges, six in here. Seriously, what's not to love? I love the Nail Guard Sponges. In general, they do not tear apart very easily. They last a really long time. You can clean so many things with them. But yes, I, I love these and I get disheartened when I cannot find the six packs because this is a really great deal. These are awesome. I always repurchase the Palmolive Soft Touch, the Almond Milk Blueberry Scent. Love this. It suds so nicely, cuts grease like no other, and the scent is amazing if you love blueberries. Like, I've never found another dish soap that just smelled like this. It's so awesome. And there was a couple more of these, um, but I threw them out. I didn't feel the need to keep all of them. And I have a Brillo Basics Wet Sweeper Cloth Refills. And there was other items too and I accidentally threw them away. I'm not even thinking. But this is what I kept to show you guys. And they're 8 count. I love these. Um, I just use them to quickly, you know, briskly mop up messes or just do the living room real quickly and i'll use them in the kitchen i i really love these they're very nice and convenient and they're very thick and quilted i like these a lot now i do use the ones from scrub buddies and you usually get about 10 in the scrub buddies and those are very nice and comparable to the brillo ones i just happened to find brillo one day and so i grabbed those to try but i do typically buy the scrub buddy ones but nonetheless they're really great and, um and then last kitchen product i have is spick and span mountain rose now sometimes they have different scents and these are 22 fluid ounces i love the spick and span sprays they are multi-purpose cleaners basically they remove dirt grease and odors and I love the ones with the scent I love the antibacterial one I use them for my counters my stove top cleaning out the sink um, random messes Connor's areas um, but I do use uh, a lot of Connor's area stuff the cleaning vinegar but I love the Dollar Tree cleaning vinegar you guys as well but this spick and span sprays love them highly recommend them and a lot of times you can find them in a lot of fun scents at the Dollar General for just a dollar couple bonus items I have to share with you guys they are kid related they're glow sticks Connor loves the glow sticks um, we use them in the bathtub not break them open or anything like that but just turn out the lights, get a bunch of different color glow sticks, and it's like a glow stick party in there. 
it he loves it he loves it and you get four for a dollar in the banet pack or the stick pack and you get like four necklaces you can get four bracelets i mean seriously that's a good deal they come in so many colors they have glow in the dark balls beach balls frisbees now so many different things they even have pirate themed glow sticks i mean how cute is that so for your little ones highly recommend the glow sticks and then last but not least here we have the crayola dough and i think this is super cute packaging i love the bright colors unfortunately this dough to me and well my son connor was no good it broke up into tiny little pieces it was kind of dry it didn't want to mold and when even when you try to squish it together and mold it with your hands to form a ball it still didn't really want to mold um i just am not a fan of this let me show you see what i'm saying like it's kind of soft but like it's comparable to like the dollar tree dough in my opinion yeah, it even smells like the Dollar Tree dough. I, yeah, it just, it was not good dough. Like, I would definitely just, in comparison, like, to Play-Doh brand, since these are a dollar a can, I would recommend just paying the dollar a can for Play-Doh or going to Walmart and buying the Play-Doh brand for 50 cents a can, which is typically what I do. I just bought, like, six the other day for Connor and Aiden to play with just don't recommend this Crayola dough like I said I think it's super cute it will make cute little gifts but it's just not good dough you guys in my opinion in mine and Connor's opinion so yes that is my household empties and I hope you guys enjoyed it and in a few months we'll probably film another one of these so stay tuned I don't want to do one every month because I buy the same things and it will just be completely reoccurring and at least in the other empties videos there is different products thrown in from time to time and the beauty empties so um yes definitely stay tuned for those videos as well i've been going through stuff like crazy lately and i have a lot of empties coming up so thank you guys always for watching i hope you enjoyed the video stay tuned for more dollar tree videos don't forget to check the description box for additional links like the video comment subscribe and ring the bell if you haven't already